Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So just a quick look at what is happening in the Dev Channel this week with Build 23585. And there are no new features this week, but um, when it comes to changes and improvements, um, Microsoft giving us the option once again to be able to debloat and thin out and uninstall a couple of the built-in stock apps. Uh, that are bundled with Windows 11, which I always think is a nice move because as I have been posting even earlier today, um, Microsoft have very driven currently to uh, de-bloat Windows 11 as an OS. And I think um, giving us the option to be able to uninstall a lot of the default or stock apps that do come bundled with the OS, in my opinion, is always a nice move in the right direction. Now, just to go through a couple of these apps that you are able to uninstall now in the Dev Channel, the camera app, Cortana, if we head down to the Photos app, the People app, and also if you do a search for MSTSC, which is the Remote Desktop Connection and the Remote Desktop um, app, those can all now be uninstalled in the Dev Channel, which previously was not the case. So that's a nice move. And as mentioned, Microsoft quite driven on debloating and giving us the option to so-called thin out and debloat Windows 11, which is always... Um, a good move, uh, if you ask me. Now, that's the changes and improvements. Being able to uninstall a lot of the built-in Windows 11 apps. And over and above that, um, we get an important fix for the explorer.exe, which is the shell of Windows 11. So that would be your taskbar, your start menu, your search, notifications, and so on where that was crashing, explorer.exe was crashing, and any fix, as I say, that fixes a crash is always um, an important fix. And then if we head over to the File Explorer, there's a context menu fix, where um, they fixed an issue causing the context menu to draw off screen when invoked using touch or pen on the side of your desktop. And then the last one, just to mention this, they fixed an issue causing the purple chat button to show up again on the taskbar, um, after updating to a previous dev channel build 23580. And as many of you will know, even in the stable version now, if we head over to our taskbar settings, uh, the chat button or chat as it was known has now been deprecated and replaced with Microsoft Teams, which you can download from the Microsoft Store. And then um, over and above that, because it is early days in the dev channel, we get a known issue for Copilot. Um, and Copilot still quite a bit of work to do as it's still in preview, but nonetheless. And then the same as the Canary channel, there's a snipping tool update where they are improving HDR display support. So screenshots and screen recording on displays with HDR enabled should be able to better display colors. So that's what's happening this week uh, in the dev channel with build 23585. And as mentioned, the key highlight is uh, Microsoft could let us uninstall even more built-in Windows 11 apps soon as mentioned today in this video. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.